everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Erica, and today I wanted to do something a little bit different. After taking a break this weekend, which was much needed, I'm back and ready to film for you guys. And today I am going to be doing an unboxing of the Nintendo Switch Lite. And I have been waiting for this for so, 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 so long. It came out on the 3rd of April in North America, so I had to pre-order it weeks ago, and I'm so excited that it's finally here and that I get to do a deep dive into the Nintendo with you guys and unbox it and show you how I'm going to like accessorize it. I'm super, super, super excited. And yeah, we're gonna get into it. It has been properly disinfected, the box, and I will um, deal with everything on the inside once we get to it, but I am so excited to share this with you guys. So let's get into it. So I'm gonna have two views going on at the same time. One's gonna be from up here, so I'll like put it somewhere in the screen or I'll either make this smaller and put it in that screen, but I will have a working screen over there so you can see everything that I'm doing with my hands because I will be putting on a screen protector, putting on a case, accessorizing it, and I'm so excited to share it with you guys. So we are going to start with the moment of truth is opening it up. So you'll be able to see both angles. I'm doing double angles, trying something new. So pretty. So, so, so pretty. I'm so excited. Okay. Ah, she's so pretty. Okay. So we're going to move this to the side. I'm going to unbox that. Okay. So we have the extension cord, um, the charging cord. So that's great. That is pretty much the only accessory it comes with, and I do believe it is charged already, so you don't need to worry about that. Put these off to the side. I need to dust this off. And now we are going to get to taking it out of the plastic. I'm gonna put this on. It looks absolutely beautiful. I love the watermelon color. So I feel like that is the best way to describe it. It's like a coral watermelon color. It looks absolutely beautiful. So I am gonna be starting with adding a screen protector on. I do that to all of my accessories. It is something I absolutely love to do. Something that I'm very good at. I know that like in my family, everybody's always like, okay, Erica. Let's go get on our screen protectors whenever we have like new tech in the house. I just like it as an extra like step of um, safety because I like to keep my stuff looking quite pristine as if it's never used, but I do use them a lot. So this kit comes with some cleaning wipes and the actual screen protector. I did choose a glass screen protector just because I wanted to um, add some more protection because the light does come with a plastic screen. So I figured if I were to just put um, a plastic like a screen protector on top of plastic, it wouldn't really provide too much protection. So I figured if I went ahead and added a glass one, I'd be able to have that extra layer of protection. So I'm going to move this close to me as I possibly can. Hopefully you guys can still see it. I'm going to try my best to wipe off all the fuzzies. Now you're going to get to see my concentration face. So, so this is where like you do it once right and you can leave it on for as long as you use the device. That's sort of like the motto. So we're going to see how good I can nail this. <laughs> So I don't know how much of that you guys will be able to see, but I have secured the screen protector. I'm just going to go ahead and rub off any of the bubbles. Okay, so my setup is complete and now I'm here at the game menu. So I'm going to continue sort of customizing it. So I'm going to turn off my console and power options turn off 
I am going to show you the way that I usually customize my devices and an easy way to do that I got these little like um, joystick covers I thought they were so cute I saw them on Amazon I can link everything below but they're really easy to find you just go to um, like joystick covers basically for the switch and I think the switch and the Nintendo uh, switch Lite they have the same joysticks so they both fit on quite simply so we're gonna try and get this on I heard that these are quite difficult to get on but we are going to try to do our best it has two of them this one's pink on white this I mean this one's pink on white and this one's white on pink very cute Okay, and the other two that I have are blue and white and white and blue. So again, customization is super, super nice and I love doing it. So we're just gonna put those back in the bag. And I'm going to clean up a little bit. Oh, there's two, three. Oh, there's other screen protectors just in case they're finicky, which is great. And that's why there are three kits each time. Basically, whenever I have a device, so usually my phone, because that is pretty much the only other device I have, but I love to customize clear cases. And the best way to do that, you can look in the screen, is to add stickers to the back. So I'll show you guys a clip of what my phone looks like. But basically, I like to take stickers, and because I'm always changing up my design and my preferences with stickers and with um, things I'm into at that moment. I love having stickers and I have, as you can see here, I have a huge sticker collection. This is a whole bag of stickers. Like it is absolutely insane how many stickers I have, but I'm gonna leave my Switch as sort of like a Winnie the Pooh theme for the moment. And I'll explain to you why this is so easy and so versatile because what I do is I don't actually stick them on to the device or onto the case. I lay them flat. I lay them flat so that you can see it behind the device. So I'm going to sort of place these all and show you what I mean. It is just absolutely beautiful. So there we go. I'm going to turn it back on and we're going to get to setting it up and actually purchasing a game. And if you guessed it, the game I'm going to be getting is Animal Crossing. I've seen so much on social media. This whole self-isolation has been full of Animal Crossing and I had just been so excited to jump on this bandwagon of Animal Crossing and the love of it. And I am so excited about that. In the meantime though, I am going to add in a um, cartridge and this is just like extra memory. That didn't do anything. <laughs> and it is just extra memory for my Nintendo because I want to only download games. I feel like having the cartridge is like nostalgic and it's super great, but I am just somebody who rather have it downloaded directly onto my device and not worry about like losing the cartridge or breaking it or anything like that, like having to store it. It's great to have stuff already stored on the actual device. So I'm just gonna open this up and this is just like, um, it's just a micro SD card and I got the 128 gigabyte one and it goes down here and you just pull it out and I think it goes this way and you just sort of stick it in like you would with a camera or if you have a phone that takes a micro SD card or like a Kobo, I think that's in. And you just kind of clip it back and then there you go you have extended memory so i'm so happy about this case this just looks so nice i'm so obsessed with it it's so cute and the, the joysticks look so nice too also it just gives it a little like you know flair i love it i'm obsessed i'm obsessed okay so i'm gonna go put some stuff away and then i'll be back so here I finally actually downloaded Animal Crossing and I just have to say that I am absolutely obsessed with these cute characters. When you start up your game, you get to name your character, put in your birthday, where my cancer's at, <laughs> and then you get to design your own personal character. And I just think they are absolutely precious. I got to customize it to my likings, the eye shape, the eye color, the hair color, the hairstyle, 
the nose I just think it look how adorable it is I even got to put lots and lots of blush because you know I like my blush nice and prominent but this game is so user-friendly so intuitive and I can't get enough of it I've been playing it for so many hours today and I am so excited I can't wait to play more after I'm done like editing this video so here you're just gonna see some cute cute game play and the maps that we get to choose i chose that one i thought it looked very nice and spacious so then you get to enjoy it and actually visit your island for the first time and i'll save that for a future video if you guys would like so if you do end up doing this to any of your devices under a clear case using stickers without actually using the stickers, definitely tag me. I'll leave my Instagram down below. You can DM me and show it to you, show it to me. I would love to see it. I'd love to like repost them or make a story about it. Like I would love to see your collections of stickers and what's sort of laying around your house and how creative you guys are. So I will leave my Instagram handle. It's just, it's Erica back and just like my full name, but I would love to see your creations and how creative you can all be. So definitely share those with you and I will be reposting them onto my story. So I would love to see that. So definitely do that because it's really exciting to see. <laughs> So that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed my little intro to Animal Crossing. I am super excited to finally have my Switch and to be able to share it with you guys. So if you want any more little videos about Animal Crossing, I'd love to share that with you guys. I will be posting a bit on my Instagram, so go check it out at It's Erica Beck, and I'll see you in the next one.